And here we are at Lolo Juice. I'm with Max, one of the owners. Good morning, Max. How are you? Good morning. Wonderful. How are you? Great. Love to be here. I got a taste of the fast break smoothie this morning, and it's so yummy. It's pretty good. That's my favorite breakfast smoothie for sure. Definitely. It definitely tastes like just yummy, comforting breakfast. Definitely. Yeah, we had that. It's got an oat, oats in it, so it's an oat flavor with blueberries. And, yeah, it definitely takes you back home for sure. That's nice, and blueberries are my favorite, so you must have known that. <laughs> yeah, it must have been intuition. <laughs> Fun. So tell us a little bit about, you know, your location, what you guys do here. Yeah, so we are uh, all organic, and we make everything in-house. Um, we do not own a microwave, and we do not own a fryer. Uh, we make everything from scratch. We use all of compostable products. We have a very green, healthy business model. Um, one of the important things to me uh, and my wife, Lori, are that everything is delicious. It's not just healthy. I feel like healthy is passed off, and, and there's a, a stigma that it's not going to taste good. And we've done our best to make everything in this place taste delicious and be healthy at the same time. So that's kind of where our direction is. That's awesome. And yeah, the things are really good. We had a Petra smoothie yesterday. I mean, you guys just, you got it going on here. Yeah, it's, uh, there's a lot of variety for sure. Like this, the Petra is much different than the fast break. Uh, our sandwiches are fantastic. I eat here every day. I don't get sick of it. Um, we can do salads and quinoa bowls and we've got soup that we make from scratch. So We've got it all. If you want to eat some lunch for a pretty good price, then swing on down to Lolo Juice. Awesome. And tell us a little bit about your inspiration to open up shop in Breckenridge. Ah, well, we would vacation here before, and my wife would eat burgers and pizza all week, which I'm cool with, but she <laughs> wasn't. So uh, when we decided that we both hated our jobs enough to quit and move, uh, we decided that this is the direction we wanted to go, is introduce into a healthy community a healthy place for people to eat. So... That's awesome, especially right on this block. You guys have got a lot of bars and burger joints, so you guys are located on the south side of town. For sure. Yeah, there is a lot of bars and burger joints, and we need those in Breckenridge for sure, but we also need some healthy and delicious options, so that's where we come in. Perfect. And you guys are involved in kind of the fitness community here as well, so, you know, the word's out there. Now everyone else needs to know about how fabulous it is in here. Uh, you give me too much credit. My wife's involved in the fitness community, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> for sure. I like skiing and that kind of stuff, but my wife's running her first ultra marathon next week, actually, 50 miler. So please, uh, everybody wish her luck. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely, it takes, it takes training and luck, that's oh. for sure. <laughs> One of those races. Yeah, what she's gone through is amazing. I'm so proud of her. So. <laughs> That is awesome. And so let's talk a little bit about um, getting here because, you know, as you know, parking's always an issue in Breckenridge. Definitely. Parking is always an issue in Breckenridge. Uh, the best places to park is you can park under the Wyndham Hotel for two hours for free uh, in a covered heated parking area. Uh, there's also 15 minute parking out in front of that. You can park in the F lot is a short walk or the Tonopa lot behind Empire Burger is also a very short walk. So Perfect. Cool. So if people um, are walking from Main Street, how are they going to get here? Walk south. Uh, we're basically at the intersection of the South Light at Park and Main um, on the southwest corner of that intersection. Perfect. And if people want to call ahead or maybe find you on the Internet, where can they go to? Uh, LoloJuiceBreck.com. And you're certainly welcome to call ahead and place an order. And, and we'll certainly give you a time in which you can pick it up. So it might make it a little quicker to get in and out. Um, we definitely take call-in orders. We're working on some delivery, but we don't have that quite yet. <laughs> All right, cool. In progress. <laughs> All right. Cool. Well, everybody, come into Lolo Juice. Get some soup or a smoothie or whatever your heart desires. They've got your healthy options here. And we are going to be back in just a little bit. We'll see you soon.